So this question says, in right triangle ABC, angle C is the right angle, and BC is 162. I'm going to draw that. Right triangle, right angle, that's C. So the other sides must be A and B. And then BC is 162. Perfect. Point D on side AB is connected by a line segment with point E on side AC, such that such that line segment DE is parallel to BC. So let's draw that first. Um, we can continue reading. Actually. Such that line segment DE is parallel to side BC and CE is two times AE. So quite a bit going on. I'm going to use a different color. So what do they tell me? Point D is on side AB. So I put that there. That's D. And then E is on side AC. I'll put that there. I know that I want those two lines to connect in a way that makes them makes this line parallel to BC because that's what it says, parallel to side BC. And then how do I translate this? CE, so this distance, I'll highlight in green, this distance is two times this distance AE. Okay, so I'm going to say that this distance is distance X, and that makes this distance here distance of 2X. Okay. What is the length of line segment DE? So DE is what I want. So I'm going to just label that as Y. I want that line. So whenever I see this type of question, whether I'm drawing it myself from translating a word problem or the question provides some diagram like this, let's not forget this is going to be 90 degrees here as well because, because these line segments are parallel. Um, I like to separate them. I like to draw them as two separate right triangles. And usually it makes it very simple because the process with these is very um, conformed. It means it, it usually leads to us having our original triangle and the new triangle. And those triangles are similar. Let's see if that happens here. So I have my right angles. I have A, E, D for the small right triangle. I know this is side Y and this is side X. I have A, C, B for the large right triangle. I know this is 162. And I know this is 3X, right? Because X plus 2X is 3X. And um, in order to know if these two triangles are similar, I need to know at least that one other angle besides the 90 degree angle is congruent between these two. And I know, I do know that. So they both have angle A. They both share angle A. So I can now say that these two triangles are similar. And because, the, because they're similar, that means that the corresponding sides are proportional. So that means Y, the relationship between Y and 162 is the same as the relationship between X and 3X. And we already know that relationship, right? Like triangle ABC is three times larger than triangle ADE. We know that because of this X and 3X here. So I can make a proportion. I can say, well, X over 3X must be equal to Y over 162, right? Like that's what I can do when I know I have similar triangles. So then simplifying this, my X's are gone. So I'm left with one third equals Y over 162. I can cross multiply here to get 3Y equals 162. And then I can divide both sides by 3 to get Y equals 162 divided by 3 is 54. So there's my answer, right? So the length of uh, DE here is 54.